everyone how are you all doing my name is richa i'm back again with the next video and today we are going to make our chatbots for human resources yes we are going to learn practically how i can build the chatbots which can make my work easier as an hr excited to learn okay so before we start Uh, learning about today's video i just want you to subscribe the channel hit like comment and now let's go and start learning hi everyone let's start now learning about chatbot so i have made account in zoom bot with your normal gmail id you can create an account there are various templates they have for the various things okay so after the name i just want the person to fill up what position the candidate is applying for so you have to relate the arrow so here there are different buttons it's a sales position marketing you can change it customize it so now for the different different situations what are your requirements example for the sales position i have a full time job part time job for design i want a portfolio for tech i want a github link so you can link that with an open answer or you can even use the radio button for this now as you my want in marketing department my requirement is that i want the person's resume to be uploaded so you have a multiple options here when you want a file to be uploaded you have to select file upload and you want only in the case of a marketing department so you have to link it let's say marketing department has to linked here correct right i don't want marketing to be linked here i want marketing to be linked here so now it's linked if you will see it's for the marketing department and i want to say upload your resume save same way whatever your pre request or a pre requirement for that particular position you can in a one bot only you can ask whatever the candidate will select or according to that the bot will show the next question to the candidate same way how many experience for the different different location a uh, different different sorry departments you want to uh, see that also you can put a buttons and let the candidate put it and you can customize this entire bot according to your requirement now let's see once you have filled this how it looks like let's go to preview now let's see when you will customize how it will look like so all the people who will be filling this that will come in analytics conversations you would be able to see also and you would be able to download also go to configure share and this is the bot link which you can give to the people who is applying now that was the thing we have made okay now the second question was what job now is it giving the same radio buttons what we have described in the bot now if i'm saying marketing it is asking me to upload the resume right like this you can upload like this you can customize the bot according to your requirements so that your manual work can be saved the whole idea of creating the chat bot in recruitment or employee engagement is when you have a multiple situations and it's a every time you have the same situation coming and you need not to answer for the same things you can create a chat bot and give the link to the people and let the people fill it and your all the answers will get customized here we can come to analytics conversations so this is what i have filled there i am able to see that if i'll export in csv even whatever the attachment i have i am bringing from the candidate like their resume they will be stored in a aws link you will get a aws link so that's the reason you have their resumes also properly structured maintained and sometimes when we are doing the recruitment we have the same question repetitively we have to ask from everybody 
what's your notice period what's your salary what so you can use such bots for pre-filtering rather than calling the candidates and you can save your time so let's see how we can use once again we can create the account in one of the tool zoom bot it's a free tool some features are free for lifetime some features like uploading resume is paid you can try this there are so many pre-built templates they already have. Just go to new chart bot. Go to human resources. Example now, let's take the another employee engagement. Use this template. There are so many buttons or options already given. You can customize your bot. You might remember we did when we started learning the computers, we learned about the workflows. It's same like a workflow. You can customize your workflow. Okay, if the candidate will give this answer, then what to show. If this answer, then what to show. Multiple situations, everything. You can use these options. Mult uh, set up the examples or set up your questionnaires. What you want the candidate to answer. Whatever the candidate will fill. Right? Let's say I want to check certain things. I'll first put the name. So you will put, okay, I want to check the experience. Then you want the employee to rate you on the scale of 1 to 5 for all the questionnaires. You can fill it. If somebody is giving you less score, you can put up the next question why you are giving the less score, which you are not able to do it in the Google Forms. Correct? So for a one person, if somebody is giving you two score, then what to show, three score, then what to show, four score, then what to show. These all things you can customize in this bot so the bots can be used not only in recruitment or employee engagement in all stages of hr cycle you should know how to make this workflow that's the only logic and it's very simple like okay if this is yes go to this this is no go to this it's so simple when you will practice in a one bot only you will be able to understand this entire workflow then use such workflows for all your hr automation that will save a lot of your time I hope you have liked the today's learning. If yes, hit like, comment and let me know what other videos you want me to record. And I am expecting this video to be shared along with another HR fraternity, another friends. And do visit our website www.theskilldeck.com for our upcoming live courses. Download the Skill Deck app for any pre-recorded courses. You can download it through Android store. I'll see you in the next video. Bye. Bye-bye. Take care.